Good afternoon and salam, Ibu Pertiwiku. Australia's Bureau of Meteorology said Wednesday, Cyclone Oma had intensified to a damaging Category 3 storm and warned it could bring severe weather conditions to the continent after hitting the Pacific Islands. In the early hours of Wednesday, Oma produced winds of up to 185 km per hour, roughly equivalent to a Category 1 hurricane. New Caledonia's Civil Security Agency reported on Tuesday that around 3,000 people were without power and dozens of telecommunication towers were affected. The storm also produced a torrential rain in Vanuatu where clean-up operations are underway. The storm is expected to bring abnormally high tides to parts of southern Queensland on Australia's east coast as it edges closer. President Vladimir Putin on Wednesday said Russia would have to deploy missiles targeting decision-making centers if Washington sends missiles to Europe. The announcement comes after the U.S. said it would withdraw from a key Cold War-era arms treaty over what it said were Russian violations prompting a mere move from Moscow. Putin said during an annual State of the Nation address, Russia does not intend to be the first to deploy such missiles in Europe, but if the U.S. develops and deploys them in Europe, this will dramatically exacerbate the international security situation, creating serious threat to Russia. He earlier accused Washington of, accuse of using far-fetched accusations to withdraw from the Intermediate Range Nuclear Forces INF, agreement. The United States has repeatedly accused Russia of violating the INF by developing banned we weapons, and this month President Donald Trump said Washington was starting to process to withdraw from the treaty. And that is all for me. I'm Imes Reni for TV Sarawak. Anytime, anywhere.